Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Retro Pop Planet. My YouTube feed has been blowing up lately with anime glass paintings and I thought I would just throw my own hat in the ring. I picked up this cheap frame from the dollar store and it's very reminiscent of a 1970s and 80s arcade laminate cabinet. I instantly thought Pac-Man because, well, I love Pac-Man, but also because I have an original arcade marquee displayed in my house. There was a very short-lived Hanna-Barbera cartoon from the early 80s. I think it only lasted two seasons. I barely remember it. But the artwork was indelible to the early versions of Pac-Man. There's nothing fundamentally new with anime glass painting. This is essentially an animation cell, which traditionally would have been done on a plastic overlay. The challenge with glass is that there are a number of different ways that this project can fail. The liner can smear, the paint can crack, there can be coverage issues, and you're working in reverse. The cocktail cabinets of Pac-Man and Donkey Kong were the first time I ever remember playing a video game. I would beg my parents for quarters at the pizza parlor. I've studied the pattern before, but I can usually only get through the first five levels before the game starts really getting challenging for me.
let me know what you think about this in the comments and I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notifications tab so you can keep up to date with my next video. Thanks for watching. Now let's hit those money shots.